Hello and welcome to paradise. This is Cookie and today we are definitely going to get our spiky boy. I mean social distancing zombie. Uh, and probably going to get at least one of the alloy plates from the, the fencing which is down here and down here. There may even be some. No, just those two. Alright. So those two. And uh, build a few bridges to see what else is out there. So, uh, let's get the show on the road. Alright, a quick check on our little wood situation. It seems they're still alive, haven't been attacked again, which is nice. <laughs> uh, I have decided to go up here first. So we're going to go fix this bridge right there, and then head across. I'll see you there. Alright, so we have found more spiky boys. We are going to get that damn thing. <laughs> we have to. We have to. Or I'm gonna die. Oh dear. <laughs> Alright, take out the pylon and then hopefully, hopefully, we will have our spiky boy. Let's see. Yes! Yes! We got Spiky Boy. We got our Spiky Boy. All right, let's set this up. Okay, Spiky Armor. And then we give you a bat. There we go. Look, we have a Spiky Boy. Isn't that great? <laughs> yes, I'm stupidly excited over having that. <laughs> okay, and we repair the bridge. And what is across the bridge? Let's see. Paradise entrance. Okay, yeah, so that heads down there as well. Oh, hello. Good morning. No, you're gone? What about you? No, you're... Oh, you are gone. Okay. So we'll just have a quick look around, see what there is. Ooh, what's this? Where are we? Have we looked in this bit before? Not yet. Alright. Um, okay. It is empty. And, oh, we're in someone's territory. Where are we? Who are you? Um, are those bodies in that trash can? Outpost Annie's camp. Okay. Uh, these look like... Yep, those are bodies. Alright. So, yeah. We are right here. Right here. What is outpost? Oh, my God. What? I? I don't know what to think about this. Uh, hello? Annie? What have you been up to? This is disturbing. And there is no one around? We've just... Oh, what's that? Bandage? Thank you. Oh. Right, so we have things showing up here. Can I not talk to you? Is there anything I can do? In the machines? I can walk in there and I can't see a thing. That is not good. Okay, so we've got Annie's Infirmary and Kate. So Kate, 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 where is Kate? Are you Kate? It looks like you might be Kate. You or you and nothing's happening. Okay. Righty-o then. So we can explore down this way. Or we can go upwards. Why don't we go upwards for a little bit and then head back down this way. Seeing as I found my spiky boy. And we have to get the alloy plates at some point. I know. And flashlight on. But that Annie's camp is a little disturbing. Though what can you expect for a zombie game, right? <laughs> hmm. How are we going on bandages here? And we've got some wood here. Nice. I've decided I'm not going to uh, be friends with the broken zombots. I'm just going to destroy everything. That way I can 
level up and just get all the materials I need to survive because I haven't been doing so well. <laughs> I need to make more armor, get the full kit and caboodle going. Anything up here? No, is that the end of this part of the map? Yes. So then we can go up here. And yes, I know I am avoiding getting the uh, alloy plates. I just, you know, I don't want to pull the walls off right now. I, you know, our base got attacked yesterday and we don't have full walls and you guys have guns. Okay. Just keep attacking. Don't take a break. You don't need to take a break. You really don't. And there we go, we leveled up. Nicely done. Okay. And that's all that. So when we level up, we heal as well. I just noticed. It took me a long time to notice that. It's one point. We can go into these and then that will unlock the next level up. Don't really need the both will steed, to be honest. And I don't want them to run away. I'm not going to be using the stealthy shot. Uh, perfect executions which will inflict a lot of damage on surrounding enemies. Sounds fun. There we go. So these are all common air pistols from these guys. I've been going around trying to figure out what type of zombie gives what and okay we have lit torches does that mean people let's go for our mega loop first see where we are outpost muddy forest entrance muddy forest okay i'm guessing that's swampland oh wow things go quite away i didn't realize <laughs> anything of interest down this oh, oh damn you guys move quick. And you are quite wrongish. Or I'm just not doing too well at the moment. Come on, finish them off. Oh, yeah, it does damage them. Good to know. Finish them off. So there you go, it does do... hang on, chainsaw? A chainsaw, okay that is really cool. That is awesome. And... I'm leaving the pylon up because I want to see what these guys look like. Oh, no wonder we're having trouble, we're in the swamp and it's 25 to 35. So we aren't going to go any further than this. We're just going to keep hacking away. Alright, pick all of this up. Okay, yeah, so that's what you guys look like. I love how they come flying out of the pylon. How do the guns work on you? Ooh. And we leveled up again. Black powder. Yeah, uh, it doesn't do the best. Alright, let's take out the pylon now. Even the pylons are stronger. Alright, we've got all that. Pick up all of this. Give a quick look at that chainsaw. Where'd you go? Oh, I've got to be level 27 to use it, but it does 500, 500 damage. That is awesome. That is absolutely awesome. Okay. So, what's in here? Scrap. Give me the scrap. Come on. Give it. Thank you. I want to find some more of Bob's archives. So we know what we're dealing with. Okay, um, let's just go back to Annie's camp. 
All right, Annie's camp, and we will go and fix a couple of bridges. There it is. Repair the bridge. And remember, I do. I think I have that skill. Um, not. Yes, yeah, service station. Replace dead zombots with each fast travel and heal the ones that are still with you. Oh, right. Hang on. Let's make another one of these. And we'll see if we can get a second zombot. And we did level up, that's right. So, what should we do? I have an extra 20 health already. Increases the effectiveness of bandages. Thank you. And sure, we'll go for extra scrap. How are we going on ammo? It's alright for now. I can now use the refined air pump gun, which does four, uh, takes four bullets a shot. Not the best. Okay. Where's the next broken bridge? They're all down here. Alright, so we can just jump to the forest centre. I do love this mega loop thing. It's awesome. I always love fast traveling games. Yes, it takes you out of the immersion. I get that. But... You just want to get where you're going. <laughs> Actually, we'll go to Pedro because that doesn't link into where the forest camp is. It is to an island. So we'll do these three and see what's down here. And then maybe go hunt some geese or something. I saw them around. See what they drop. See what we need it for. So, yep, up and around and over there. Gotcha. Yeah, can we speak to you? No. We've done a good deed for you and that's it. Good to know. And we go around and around. That was interesting over there. Is that... I, I'm going to go check that out. Hang on. Can we not get in there? What is this? Oh wow. Oh damn. Oh, damn. I have made a mistake. I have really made a mistake. Alright. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you can just bugger off and all. Oh, you're an anti-projectile zombie. And you've gone into the section that I can't get to. Good to know. Oh yeah, you hold, I think, you hold down the button and you hit harder. Yeah. But it uses stamina. Hang on, is that, is that a treasure chest? I did not know we had treasure chests here. Ah, it is. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Actually, let's organize my inventory first. All right, inventory organized. Let's see what is in this. And we have to hold it down. Of course we do. Pedro's golden knife. Okay. Okay. It's a resource. Beautifully balanced throwing knife. Made of 24 karat gold and engraved with the name Pedro Ruiz Salvation. Fancy. Um. Oh no. Wake up. Wait, I can't revive you? There we go. <laughs> okay, and we will go back to fixing the bridges. It's always worth building bridges in your life. Build the bridge. I need more rope. Okay, build the bridge. And across we go, and we go down here, and around, and yada yada yada. And we can drink from the water. Not sure that's the greatest idea. Yep, another bridge here. And there's a bridge up here, because I want to see what's on the island. I wonder if after we've cleared out the zombies, do they stay cleared out? Oh. Ooh. Hello, little... whatever you are. Oh, damn. Why are you so hard to kill? Oh, 
Oh man, look behind us. Oh dear, oh dear. Let's just go. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> Where the hell did they all come from? And why are we getting scrap? Are they like little robots? And there's another treasure chest. Alright, so that's two treasure chests today. I'm not sure if we're meant to be finding them yet. Another Pedro's golden knife. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so then we go, we're going to go down here and see what's happening. Down and around through this area. I'll see you there. Alrighty, so we have a big open space. Anything to check out? A little hidden area with a lot of sage. Sage is good, sage makes bandages. Yeah, okay, hand me the sage, thank you. They look so funny waddling along like that. Alright, let's just check out this area before we head off to the right. There's some more leaves. And it goes up and through there. Alright, so we'll go down to the right first of all, I think. I am going to try out the refined pump gun. Just for the hell of it. I wonder, is it 70 per shot or 70 per bullet? Because if it's per bullet, that's... what are you? Um, you guys are just... Uh-oh. Throwing sticks at us? Good to know. Logging area. New area. I love how it's got an automatic reload. Alright, there is nothing here telling me I can, you know, collect a new Zombot. Which is a shame. I would like more than one. Hello. Goodbye. I really need to get some leather so I can upgrade my bat. I would like to do that. Oh, hello. More bell guys. I need to find more of the Bob's archives so I can figure out what these guys actually are. I mean, I know they've got bells on them. But, there we go, see? Zombie bell. <laughs> I think they work similar to the uh, trumpeters. Oh look, there's um, another one of those guys. Yeah, it's not a great idea to use a gun on that, but it's not the guns I've got. Maybe it's just I can't aim. I'll just reload that. Scraps. Oh, hello. Oh, we can take this one. I don't want to take that. I'm just going to go this way. Oh, just as I was speaking about Bob's archives, here is another one. What do we got? Bob's Archives P-42-4, the Zomot Bug. Open the portable pylon configuration menu. Equip your Zombot with anti-projectile armor and an air pump gun. Easy! Enable the use, intimidate, and flee commands while in combat. Switch to Expert mode to use the modules. Assign the High Life module to the Intimidate command and the Diminish Life module to the Flee command. And that's it! This Zombot will intimidate its enemies and will flee if it takes a beating like the big coward that it is. Okay, that... hang on. Expert mode? Oh wow! <laughs> That's really cool. And a Zombot pug. Nice. Hello, goodbye. How am I getting that guy? Yep, 
you're dead. Isolated Paradise Camp Stones. Take out the pylon. Oh, goodbye. Stones. What do we do with stones? Found in the forest where rocks roam wild and free. Throw it at an enemy, preferably at their head. Um, right, okay. This is a glowing thing. I I can't get to my little treasure chest. Oh no! Oh no, why can't I get to it? That's annoying. And... Yep, that's as far as we can go here. So was that... Yeah, there's a hunting area just through here as well. This little bit here. So I guess we have... You. <laughs> okay, do you give me anything? No, you just disintegrate. Okay. What was that? A, a marmot? A ferret? A chipmunk? I have no clue. Okay, and off to explore more. Oh, we've got the booster guys. Hello. Whoa, lots of booster guys. Well, it certainly takes down um, pylons easier using the using the gun. So we found so many zombies that we haven't actually found a Bob's archive for. I guess they'll be around somewhere. So we've already gone down that area. What is up here? Oh, these are the um, bugs. I think they're called. No, they're trumpeters with freaking anti-projectile armor on them. Wonderful. Just get rid of the trumpeters. And everything else. And take down this. It's a good thing that my spiky boy doesn't hurt me with his spikes. That would be unfortunate if it happened. There we go. Pick everything up. Anything of interest? Go to the right. Oh! Cremation area. Okay, so we can't use a bat on this guy. But we can use guns. Good to know. Heavy armor. All right. Oh, whoa! I'm getting attacked by this weird thing. Okay, so we have anti-projectile armor, which means we need to use melee, and then we have the heavy armor, which means we need to use the gun. Nice. Oh, wow. Yeah. Information area, that's all. That's true. I should probably heal up. Oh. Can you just get off of my leg? Damn. Damn. I can't get it off. How am I going to get it off? I'm screwed. I'm absolutely screwed. Oh, he got it off me. Thank you. Bloody hell. That was something. Alright, what's going on up here? Oh. Oh, oh dear. Are you guys carrying from me? Okay. That's weird. My mega loop, mega loop. Outpost Tusk Town. Okay, good to know. Um, whoa, 15 to 20, yeah. Well, at least the gun works. Mm. 
No, missed. <laughs> Gotta wait for him to stand back up again. So this is a 15 to 20 area. Do I really want to chance it? I suppose we can have a look. Can we get in there? In. There's stuff in there. I can't get in there to get stuff. Okay. I'll have a quick little whoa look around. See what we can find. I don't want to. Oh, that said capture. Hang on. Oh, uh, that's because my zombot's dead. Right. Where are you? Be good if it, you know, showed up. You're not there. Capture. Like, dude's got like a bright green head and purple jumpsuit and I can't find the bloody thing. Where are you? Uh, oh, raccoon. Oh, you guys have anti-projectile armor on. Quick, quick, quick. Whoa, yeah, you guys are strong. <laughs> That. Yeah, uh, what? Are you dead again? Damn. Okay. That's frustrating. Hacking helmet required. Ah, uh, yeah. There we go. So, this part is way too strong for me right now. Let's go back down here. Okay, have a quick look. Yeah, that's too much for us. Interesting. Entry point. So if we come back down through here, and we'll try and have a look at this bit over here. Alright. Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I took a wrong turn, I took a wrong turn. Buddy, where am I? I'm on an island. Oh, that is so good, that little finish off thing. It just does a nice little... I'm dying. I'm dead. God, I lost 4,390 points. Damn. So, what just happened there? Oh, okay. Entry point? Um, that. <gasps> Did I accident? I accidentally went in there. Bloody hell. Okay. Now we know. Don't go in there. Okay, I am, yeah, I am at Pedro's. And my Zombot's there. So, is there any way we can just teleport to around here? No, they're all broken. Alright, I'll just go down that way. Oh, I can't believe I did that. That's so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> oh well, you live and you learn. Or in this case, you um, die and respawn. Hey look, he's back. Hello. Bloody hell, I can't believe that. <laughs> Alright, so, yeah, we can just go and have a look. Exploration is the name of the game. Oh, we have a communication terminal here. Hello. So this would probably be another good place to build. If you wanted to. What's down there? That just goes down to the logging area. Hey, there we go. We've got the anti-projectile armor now. So, that does what? Metal vest thick enough to absorb damage from bullets or make them bounce off you like plastic pellets. Okay, and oh yeah, we got the bells before as well. It attracts wild zombies. I, why? Why would you want to do that? So, what level was it I needed to get to for that chainsaw? 27. Damn. I really want to give that a go. 
There we go. And there's a hunting area here, but for what I do not know. Up we go, up we go. Oh boy, you have bees. Uh, why do you have bees? I don't want bees, thank you. No one wants bees. Um, and it looks like the bees are still going, so I'm not going to touch that. Oh, I can get you to collect them. Nice. Does that mean... Yes, that means that they don't affect me. Okay. Uh, there, collect that for me too, please. You're such a good spiky boy. Yay. Thank you. You know, I think I'm changing my mind about this gun. Yes, it shoots off four shots at a time, but scrap is quite easy to come across. Um, and it does a decent amount of damage. You guys have boosters on. Whoa. Uh-oh, you hit me. Don't hit me. Oh, shite. Uh, don't try and aim and move. So don't hold down <laughs> your right mouse key and try and move. It doesn't work well. You're very slow. There we go, good boy. And I'll have to clear out my inventory again. Oh, there's another communication tower. No. Whatever you want to call it. Yeah, that's a good thing uh, with these guys. Look, see booster? Scrap. So once you've earned it, it just gives you scrap. <laughs> okay, so I ran out of leaves. I can't make the last leg. <laughs> I'm sure I'll find some more soon. Oh, damn, look at my health. Hang on a second, look at me. Ah, look, you can see the armor on her. That is... Why did I do that? I wasted a bandage. That's really cool. Alright, I was coming around areas. Oh, Oh, hello. Forest mass grave. Hello. This is... Weird. What, did they have, like, Vlad the Impaler or something? Like, just scorched earth and impaled zombies and mass graves. That's lovely. Absolutely lovely. Charming, even. Alright. Okay, well, um... Oh, yeah. We haven't gone to that bit yet. We'll head down here, get that. There it is. There's my little mega hoop. Outpost Forest East unlocked. Okay, so... Why don't we just jump home? There we go. And we are back home. Yay, we have leaves. I can make the rest of the armor I need. I will make that last piece of armor. Oh, is it right leg, right? Yeah. There you go. We are fully armored up. What do we need to upgrade that bat again? Leather. Let me think. Where? Hmm. I'm going to take a quick jaunt up here. Uh, because obviously we can't go in there, and this is a little closer to our level. So I'm going to jump up there, see if we can get some leather, if we can upgrade the bat, and then we can attempt one of these. Alright, and here we are, in the hot area. 10 to 20. And, oh, gazelles. You have leather, there we go, awesome. So a gazelle will give you leather. Do you have any more for me? Yes. Gazelle meat horns and bones. Okay. There we go. We have done that. So now we can just bump home. That was quite simple, wasn't it? <laughs> and we will upgrade. Come on. Upgrade the bat. There we go. Oh, you gotta be, you gotta be level 16. Are you, 
freaking kidding me. All right. Bones can be used to make a variety of strong lightweight objects, gazelle meat, 10% healing. Horns are a hunting trophy that can be attached to a helmet. Okay, good to know. Bugger it, I'm going to go level up. Let's go explore. Up and around this way. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Oh. Oh. Interesting. Is this what, like an enemy camp or something? Uh oh. Oh dear. I think it might be an enemy camp. That's kind of cool. Dude, why are you attacking that stuff when you could be attacking these guys? Yeah, you go attack that. Is that a dust storm? I remember when we had a dust storm where I live. Oh my god, it was like the whole world was on fire. Or at least that's what it looked like. Okay, so there's that, there's that, and then there's this one here. Okay, is that all of them? It is, by the looks. Is our health going down? I don't think so. Not from the dust storm, but we can't move very well. Oh, machete! Nice. All right, what? Let me just get everything here, and then we can have a look. No, I don't want to interact in with whatever that is. Whoa. It's getting like dark and stuff. Nice. What's this? Ooh. Davis land armor right leg. Okay. So we picked up machete. 50 and 36 to the 17. Yes, please. And where was that armor piece? There. Right leg. Three armor value to one armor value. Yep. There we go. Awesome. Awesome sauce. Can I give you a machete? I can give you a machete. <gasps> I can give you a chainsaw. <laughs> yeah, we'll keep you on that. Anything else I can give you? Alright, that's cool. That's cool. Let's just leave you on the chainsaw. That's freaking awesome. Alright, I'm going to get out of that. So, we, what's this say? Enemy camp. There you go. That's something different. Anyway, what was I doing? Yeah, leveling up. Let's just look around and have some fun, see what we can find. Okay. Finish off. Yeah, yeah, I keep running out of ammo. You only get like four shots. There we go. Okay, you can finish that off. This is the end over here. Just air pistols and the heavy armor and the machete. Okay, so what is down there? I can't see. Oh, there seem to be quite a few zombies down there. Okay, we've got all of this here to have a look at as well. Let's not, you know, just run out of the place. Oh! Okay. So you guys are the hiding ones, and you have machetes. And you do a lot of damage. Gotcha. So this is not a good distance shooting thing. Doesn't do much damage from a distance. Yeah, you can... <laughs> oh, okay, we've got a little heat thing above our head. 
Does that mean we are overheating, getting sick, whatever? Looks like it's not good, whatever it is. So maybe we will head back home until we can figure this out. Was there anything else? Yeah, common machete. So which way's home again? <laughs> okay. Down this way, that's right. Oh. Hello. And we are level 14. Not that I need to get to um, level 16 anymore, because I got my uh, yeah, I got my machete. Be sure to drink. I don't have anything to drink. Where do I get something to drink from? All right. Head home. All right. So the difference between the machete, 50, and we're about 129. Oh, I mean that would be cool, but it's also level 16. I think it's head. Can we upgrade the machete? No, we cannot. Oh well. Now, where did we have to go to get these? There. There's one there and one down there. Alright, let's go down here. Okay, so we are pretty much here. Let's hope we don't die, yeah? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, what do we got around here? Anything of interest? Okay. Um, yeah, you can die. What's this? Bandage. Handy. Just give it, thank you. Anything else? Another bandage. That's... Can we read that? No. Alright, anything down here? Leaves. Anything in this one? Nada. Alright. Ay 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 ay. Are we ready for this? Probably not. Retrieve. Run, run, run. Shoot. Reload. Shoot. Come on. Hey, this is actually going okay. Don't don't jinx it. Don't jinx it. Please don't get stuck in areas. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I like this. And I do like that it's got an auto reload. Look at him with his chainsaw and his spiky boy outfit. That is cool. Is that everyone? Oh. Treasure chest. Yay. Are you serious? Zombie mask armor. Yes, of course. There we go. Nice. <laughs> well, seeing as that was a lot easier than I expected, let's go do the other one. Anything this way? Okay, so we have a weird path down here. Let's uh, see what... Boobies. Come on, my dear friend. With matching faces. <laughs> Come and collect these beehives. Thank you. Thank you. And that one. Actually, I'll put the... Can I put the honey into... Where did that go? I dropped it on the floor. Add shortcut is one. No. Add shortcut. Uh, can I switch those around? I guess not. Alright. Oh, there's a, another treasure chest down here. God, we're just getting everything today, aren't we? And what do you have for me? Oh. Pedro's golden knife. Seriously? <laughs> Alright, we'll go back to the other one and see what we can do. Hello. Goodbye. I just had to have a look, didn't I? <laughs> uh, it's not that bad. These guys are pretty simple. Alan Tusk Memorial. Alright. The conquest of space. Work on artificial intelligence. 
neural implants to make humankind more efficient and orderly. And research into rebuilding the DNA of extinct animals. These are just some of the examples of Alan Tusk's legacy. Legend has it that Alan Tusk came up with the idea for his first inventions, Power Everywhere and Mega Hoop, while on a camping trip in this very spot which took an unfortunate turn when he ran out of food and electricity during the night. 20 years later, he was building the first prototype for Power Everywhere, a reversible electric induction charging matrix in this very forest. This revolutionary technology replaced electric outlets in all modern buildings, and its powerful electromagnetic field even increases life expectancy as demonstrated by all the studies we have published. Never be afraid of the dark again with power everywhere. You are also standing on top of the first prototype for another invention, the Mega Hoop, an ultra-fast pneumatic delivery system for small, medium, and large packages. Rollout of the Mega Hoop across the country was suspended after protests from the United Delivery Person Coalition, who saw it as a threat to the primary source of employment worldwide. Thankfully, Alan Tusk presented his arguments and the many advantages of the technology, and the rollout resumed with a successful delivery rate of 84%. Alan Tusk chose to be cryogenically preserved here, under this monument, close to his inventions. Um, all right, all right. Uh, so are they saying that are they trying to lead him to that he possibly, uh, I don't know, created the zombie apocalypse? <laughs> maybe, maybe not. We will see. All right, no more. No more side trips. We just got to get down and get this and then build our rocket launch pad thingy. Here we go. Retrieve. Go away, turn around, and shoot. 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 Reload. Shoot. 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 <laughs> and don't get too close, you're getting overconfident. There we go. Oh, is my zom zombie friend, like, stuck? Come on, man. You're meant to be helping me out. Why aren't you helping me out? Do you not like me anymore? Come on. <laughs> yeah, go the chainsaw. Alright, anything else down here? Yep, there we go. And here's our treasure chest. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Zombie mask with pigtails. Oh, I am totally wearing that. Yes, please. There we go. Okay, that's that's freaking perfect. Oh my god. I love it. Alright, well, I will see you back at base and we will build this thing. Alright. God, I love that. That is freaking awesome. Okay, building. Where are you? Not that. This. I need rope. Of course I need rope. You always need rope. I'll do some of that. And now, build! Weird look thing. Put you here. Sure. There we go. We are done. Talk to Jeff. Hello, Jeff. Hello, hello. Still alive. Great news. Speaking of news, I've got some good news and some bad. Let's start with the good news. You've been accepted into H2. Your luxury condos are waiting for you here on the moon. 24-7 view of Earth. The bad news, which isn't all that bad, is that our board of directors has judged it too risky to come and get you. But not to worry. Our latest rockets can be built as easily as Scandinavian furniture. You just need to find all the parts, assemble them on the launch pad, and that's it. Off to H2 and the good life. Given all the launch tests we did in the area, you should easily find what you need to build your own rocket. Start by searching in our launch base. It's in the desert area, just north of the forest. All right, there you go. So we have to search for everything and make our own rocket. Okay, I think I'm going to leave this here for today. So we finally, finally got our spiky boy. 
and we've got some awesome masks <laughs> and now we have the launch pad and now we have to build a rocket so i just want to say thank you so much to everyone for being here you guys are absolutely awesome the support is amazing you have no idea uh if you have any tips tricks suggestions if i missed anything leave it down below in the comments if you liked what you see and you want to see more hit that you know thumbs up and subscribe button and uh i will see you guys next time thank you so much bye